Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to see how to create the simple animated login and sign up form using jQuery. See the final demo, here we can toggle between the login form and sign up form. And whenever we focus on the input fields, we can see the green border is highlighting the input fields. For code, you can visit my CodePen profile. I'll drop the link to the code below this video. Feel free to visit my CodePen profile. CodePen is an online editor, where we can edit our HTML pages and preview the result instantly. We can save our projects in it. Let's get started with HTML structure. First, create the container development and within it, Consider two developments with login and sign up classes, which are used as buttons for toggling between login form and sign up form. Let's open the HTML structure in the browser. Now let's get started with CSS, by including its link in the head section of the HTML document. For this demo, I'm using Roboto font family. Now start writing the CSS by setting the margin and padding values of all default HTML elements to zero. Use the user select property to prevent the user from selecting and copying the text on the page. Set the background color and font family to the body. Now set the width and place container in the center of the browser. For placing any HMTL element in the center, set the width and set the margin left and margin right to auto. Now style the login and sign up div elements, by setting its width to 50%, so that both elements occupy the half of the width of the container. Set the white background color and float them left. Set height and use the text align to place the text horizontally in the center, and use the line height to place the text vertically in the center. Use the text transform property to turn the text into uppercase. Now let's get back to the HTML structure, create the sign up form div element, inside the container div element. And within that, consider three input fields, one is for the email address, the second one is for username and the final one is for the password. And set the placeholder values for the input fields.
and for all three input fields use the common class input. and create a BTN development with text in it. Now below the sign up form, create the login form development, with two input fields in it. and use the common class input, and set the placeholder values for the input fields. The text we see in the input fields is the text we set in the placeholder attribute. Use the BR tag, to place the all HTML elements in new line. Now style the sign up and login forms, set the white background color and by using the box sizing property, the forms padding and margin values will occupy within the specified width and height. Now set the 40 pixels of the padding and clear the floats. Now set the 100% width and 400 pixels of the height. Now style the all input fields using the input class, set the 100% width and use the box sizing property. Set the 20 pixels of the padding and 25 pixels of the margin bottom values. Set the 2 pixels of the solid border for the input fields. Now set the font size, color and by using the outline property remove the blue outline around the input fields. Finally, use the transition value for the smooth transition effect.
Now whenever we focus into the input fields its border color should change. Using the CSS focus pseudo element, we can achieve this. Now style the login and sign up buttons, by setting its width to 100%. Background color, 60 pixels of the height and text align value to center, 60 pixels of the line height. And using text transform property turn the text to uppercase, change the color to white and set the font weight value bold. Set the 1 pixel of the letter spacing and 30 pixels of the margin bottom. Inside the login form, create the span element with anchor element in it with I forgot password or username text in it. Now style the anchor tag, by setting the text decoration value to none, and its color to black. Now let's code the jQuery, first we need to include the jQuery CDN link in the head section of the HTML structure. I'll drop the jQuery CDN link below this video. Now inside the script tags, write the jQuery code. First. Hide the login form using the jQuery hide method. Now set the login button's background color to none. Now whenever we click the login button, sign up form should be hidden using hide method and login form should enable using the show method. And now the login and sign up button background color should interchange from color to transparent.
and same for the sign up form. Whenever we click the sign up button, the login form should be hidden and sign up form should enable using the show method. And now the login and sign up button background color should interchange from color to transparent. Thank you for your attention, I hope you enjoyed the video, so don't forget to leave a like, subscribe and ask me anything in the comments section, see you in another video.